Meanwhile, India's premier space agency, ISRO, has successfully launched third development, developmental flight of small satellite launch vehicle, the SSLV. With the successful launch, the development of the SSLV, ISRO's small lift launch vehicle, is complete. This rocket can carry satellites weighing up to 500 kilograms and place them in low Earth orbit, up to 500 kilometers above Earth. The rocket carried Indian-made Earth imaging satellite, the EOS-08, to orbit. The small satellite launch vehicle is India's smallest and newest rocket. It is made with a specific purpose in mind. ISRO's PSLV and GSLV rockets take 30 to 45 days to assemble. The SSLV can be assembled in less than a week. We're coming to you from Satish Dhawan Space Center in Srihari Kota as the launch of SSLV D3 is underway. This, of course, as the name suggests, is the third and the final development flight of the SSLV vehicle, India's smallest rocket and India's lightest rocket. This is a significant mission because SSLV is a rocket that India pins big hope on. India hopes that in the coming months and coming years, SSLV can be made a rock rocket can be uh, you know made by Indian industry. SSLV can be completely transferred to Indian conglomerates who can build the rocket and also get it ready for launch. So of course overcast skies here, but it's clearly audible here the boom of the rocket, the characteristic, characteristic roar of the rocket is visible. So now this is the kind of um, enthusiasm and atmosphere here at Sri Harikota. The SSLV is soaring to the skies. This mission will be about 15 minutes long. There is uh, one satellite that it will be carrying and of course one other experimental payload that it is carrying. So this mission is crucial because once this is successful, the SSLV vehicle will be declared operational. Being declared operational also means that this vehicle henceforth can undertake more flights regularly and also can ferry customer satellites. So this is what makes SSLV a special rocket. Typically, ISRO's other rockets take almost 40 to 50 days to assemble. The PSLVs and GSLVs take that long to assemble. But this can be assembled in one week. It's made so that it can be launched rapidly, assembled rapidly. It's made using very modern processes, whereas the older rockets, PSLV, GSLV, are made with comparatively older processes. But this one is simpler to build, assemble and launch. This is what makes the SSLV a purpose-built rocket for a very lucrative market, a billion dollar market that exists globally for which there is a market to launch small satellites. That is what ISRO wants to capitalize using this vehicle. From Satish Dhawan Space Center, Sri Arikota, Siddharth MP, Beyond World is One. The SSLV had its maiden flight in August of 2022. However, that flight was not successful. ISRO learned crucial lessons from the failure Following and the sprung combined. back with a success during the second SSLV launch in February of 2023. The space agency chief confirmed the successful third launch and said everything is perfect. ISRO designed and developed the SSLV rocket to enable rapid and low-cost launches of satellites built by the Indian government and also those of customers. Unlike other ISRO rockets, SSLV is predominantly powered by solid fuel which makes it easy to build, store and launch on short notice. For all the latest news, download the Weon app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.